Hey, we have an armory. Water for packaging researched. We're getting raided, because of course we are. So let's get the dwarf and grims so we can get that gem cutters and obsidian quarries 10% increase. Iron brow. Meanwhile, iron brow will slowly sail this way. Lord of Clan Morgrim. Let me tell you. Slaughter the sheep. Having underway movement is amazing. <laughs> uh, how I have missed you, underway movement. Please don't ever leave yes. me again. Lord of Clan Morgrim. Get some bolt throwers. I'm done ready. I got all bolt throwers. We'll see how they function. Sure. Uh, oh, okay. This needs to go on somebody. Fury. So let's see. What do we got on friggin' RX here? We could probably get rid of the Rune of Parrying. I mean, that does reduce a lot of his melee defense. But this is really good. So yeah, we're gonna... Ha being able to turn somebody invulnerable and giving them 24 melee attack is just hard to ignore. Can we get any cool freaking talismans yet? Or are we just in, like, dumpster tier yet? There we go. There's an old guards tanker. Let's get that. Because that gives me regeneration and 6% more HP. As a matter of fact, we'll get a couple of those. <laughs> Rune of Penetration. Run, Ricky. Okay, so now we can get the, put that in there instead. More hit points and regen. Can I help you? That guy too, there we go. Got anything better for armor? Armor, 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 armor. Oh. 57% ward save against green skins and Skaven. Not helpful. Ranger Cloak. 7 mil defense and 5% missile resist. That's okay. 7 mil defense is pretty good. Oh, the Gatekeeper Helm. 18 armor and AoE magic resist and missile resist. Oh, there we go. The Iron Warden Shield. 5 armor, 11 melee defense. And then... Uh, if you drop... Below 50%, you get 10% damage resistance. That's really nice. Oh, I got the Star Metal Plate 2 available. 15 melee defense. 10 armor. I think for right now, we'll get this. Isn't Underway a bad thing? Underway's great. <laughs> Being able to move through the jungle is amazing. Let's do that for right now. Master. Uh, sure, we'll put a couple on there. Banner of Eternal Flame. Yeah, okay. Looks good. We'll go with that for the moment. Can I help you? We got freaking 2,000... Got two thousand. Uh, just gonna grab all these, and we can just put them. Just put them where we want them. Later. We got so much oath gold right now. Yeah. Gosh, this is gonna take a while. Maybe I, maybe I don't care enough to click on all this. Eh, uh, we'll, we'll we'll just do it for these ones, and then we'll 
but we won't go over here and do it for the other ones. Karak <laughs> says, I'll keep doing it. Is it better to start in Karak Zorn? I haven't started over there yet, so I have no idea, honestly. So many runes. Only two more. And there we go. I am well. All right, so let's see. What do I put on him? Uh, perfect vigor is nice. Eight bonus versus large is nice. Figure loss reduction. Explosive damage that reduces enemy leadership. Snipe. Missile resistance for artillery. Just 10% ward save. It's not bad. Infantry eight. Sure. Uh, so you still get the discouraged effect when you're just fighting everyone, but you don't get the stuff. You don't get the fear and terror when you're not fighting against greenskins. I mean, a rune that gets perfect vigor is pretty nice. Yeah. Good enough for right now. I get too crazy. See, so is that guy's level one anyway? Uh, the achievements are are not currently working. The achievements we're working on release. So I don't know if that's going to be an achievement or not, but they but they're currently not in the game. Dugrimo Frowner gained a trait. Pathfinder. Pathfinder, I think, is pretty good, right? Uh, it's okay. 10% increased chance of intercepting people. It's decent. If you're trying to, like, get people there dancing around you. Achievements fail if you have mods going. Um, I think you, you still get achievements with certain mods anyways. I'm not sure if it's all mods. Might be all mods. Because I've definitely gotten some achievements when I've had, like, uh, the... Just, like, the... <coughs> reskin stuff going or whatever. Sure. Oh, our port got blocked, so we just lost all of our trade. And back. <laughs> Our trade is worth 13 grand right now. Holy hell. Alright. Despoil and ravage. Iron, ah! what brings the despicable dwarfs come before me? Do they come to beg? I wonder if these guys will even let me join a war right now. They hate, they hate me so freaking much. Okay, they'll still accept that. Rune, Ricky. Yeah, right, let's go. By the up. I have eternal flame. Just put on like them, I guess. It's a lot of freaking marauder horsemen. They also have some Gorby's chariots and some Mornfang cav. They're like all horses. Holy hell. 
entire army is horses. Well, a good thing we have slayers. We unfortunately don't have any giants. Slay Hang on a second. I don't think I, I don't think I can recruit giant slayers from here, can I? No, I can't. For the king. All right. Well, nothing to it but to do it. Let's go. Yeah, all that charge bonuses. The game is like, yeah, you're gonna die. <laughs> We got cannons with bonus against large, so... And we have quarrelers. And we got long barriers, and we do have slayers, too. Unfortunately, they're not slayers with as much armor piercing as I'd like, but... Battle ready. I'm not sure how far back he's going to set up. Longbeards. Longbeards. Let's get this going on. Longbeard. Make sure that we're outside of the dead zone of my cannons, though. So we can make sure our cannons are able to shoot. More warriors. Slayers. Just kind of have the slayers sit on the backside here as well. If the cab flanks, we just rush them with them. Quarrelers. Put them there for right now. Go, guys, put them there. Stick the rune lord in the middle. All right. Donut of Doom. Yep. Cap always tries to flank. Yes, indeed. So hopefully he'll come. Hopefully he'll be like, I'm running around you. And then I'll, he'll be like, I'm running directly into Slayers. That's the hope, anyways. We'll see if it works out for us. For the Karazanko! Let's try to shoot some of those Gorby's chariots here. So those Chaos Knights with lances given the range too. We should light them up. Shoot the Mornfang Cav too. Got some okay damage going in, so that's nice. Cannon! Obviously, these guys are flanking. What else would they be doing? Move now! For the ancestors! Move now! Move some quarrelers out here. Let's get that going on. Alright, so... Enemy front line is all up in our business. So I'll we'll just have you guys light up this stuff on the backside, basically. Start bringing the Slayers around. On these flanks as well. It is a reckoning. Slay everything without a beard. Dwarves here. Here's you guys in here. Slayers. Slayers, go, go, go. Slayers. Go. Pull some of these slayers back again. It's charged. All right, turn you guys around into it. Strike out. Go. Vengeance. Let's try to phase back 
pull back some of our cannons here. Let's do that. Get you guys in here. Slayer's on the right are doing all right. On the way. Shoot those chaos knights. Shoot those chaos knights. Catapults. Light up these guys on the backside. There appears to be. Fortunately, appears to be. Some enemy cav in some of my archers. Not a fan of that. Well, this is a lot of enemy cav, I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I don't think I can. I think it's too much enemy cav. So many horses. So many horses. Ridiculous. Yeah, I think we did. Would have needed like an army of giant slayers to deal with this. Honestly, we just don't. <laughs> we just don't have the enough firepower to deal with this many armored units. Like it's, it's just so many heavily armored cab units. Yeah, I think we would need an entire army of giant slayers for this, basically. We just don't have enough otherwise. Alright, it's fine. So many horses. I think it makes Ironbrow unique, besides being extra angry for a short dude. Uh, he is a rune lord, so he's got a bunch of rune stuff. Yeah, I'm not gonna corner camp. It's not a battle that loses me the campaign, so I'm not gonna corner camp. Oh wow, it actually like killed my entire army? Interesting. Apparently there was no place to retreat to. My entire army was completely destroyed. Interesting. Thoric Iron Brow. All right, whatever. More money for me, I guess. Yeah, he's gone. Master of Rune. He gone. I mean, he's only like level freaking seven or something like that, anyways. Nah, he wasn't twenty plus. He was some ridiculously low level. So, Ironbrow has a bunch of skills that help him be a rune lord, essentially. He gets a bunch of oath gold bonuses as well. Uh, he gets to ride around an anvil of doom. <laughs> Obviously, he has all of the, the runes. He gets runesmith recruitment ranks and upkeep reduction for them. And he personally gets armor, reload time reduction for bolt throwers, grudge throwers, and quarrel units. Armor producing weapon damage for his army, extra armor for his army. And obviously, his specialty items. I don't care about the 1k out of the doors of the Lost Liga Heroes said. Eh, whatever. <laughs> don't care. He was weak. My anger burns bright. Just waiting for this to finish leveling up, essentially. He's a rune lord, not some smith. <laughs> I mean, that's just dwarves in general.
He's not a fan of technology. Where the heck did you guys come from? He's already done the patient part for several hundred years, right? Telqua. Those guys come back. Oh my gosh, look at my freaking treasure. <laughs> it's a freaking weird number. One eight 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 eight. <laughs> Get rid of these guys off my doorstep again. There we go. Have that grudge completed. All right. What's up? You know now. Let's go send an actual army to go freaking take care of this. Rune Lord of Karakazol. Like this army has freaking Ironbreakers and Quarrelers and also actual red skill tree because this guy is higher than level seven. <laughs> Should be able to go stomp their asses. Done ready. There we go. Level that up. Level up the Star Tower. And Shupatol. There we go. What needs to be done? I suppose I could send this guy over here. He could go like jump into this army. Oh man, he's gonna have to walk all the way around to do that. Oh yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Off he goes. How's my reliability rating doing? Medium. It's actually going up fairly fast. All things considered. Okay. I can hear thunder outside again. It's been raining here so much recently. Way to kill my reliability. Yeah, you know, going back on your military ally tends to tank your reliability really hard. But also, I didn't want to go to war with literally the entire world outside of my military ally. That sounds like a stupid idea. So I'll just, uh, I'll just take the hit. <laughs> it was low a couple turns, turns ago, so it is going up. Why do you even accept one of those? Because the guy had two of my freaking artifacts. And a military alliance gifts you the artifacts that the guy has in his provinces. So I took the military alliance so I could get multiple artifacts without having to go fight him for all for them, essentially. Hi. Yay. Ready to do the Rolling this guy up and around. Alright. Sacred Pools attempt number two coming up. This time, this time it's not attempt number one. Oh yeah, that's what those, that's what the, it's like orange glow is. I think that's like a, a ritual site or whatever. Or like vortex currency site or something along those lines. Something I don't care about. Pretty sure that's what that, like extra particle effect is. Oh, hey there. Sure came a long way just to die. Did 
this is a freaking weird map. It's like a... This looks like a freaking quest map or something. Yeah, does this look like a quest map? Pretty sure it is a quest map. You guys go there. It's pretty out slightly. Try to watch our flanks here a bit, because obviously they're hey have calves, so they're going to flank us. These guys out slightly. Throw hammers over here. We'll throw some iron breakers over here. We'll split our cav left and right. Carnosaur hole on the right. Thane can go there. Green Smith can go Don't there. Wrong. Have him go up the middle. Let the vengeance begin. Well, he's got the whole position, and let's do it. This falls to the distance. Look nice. Yeah, the backgrounds on the maps are usually pretty freaking dope looking. Or with these sight lines. Why can't I shoot these guys? I guess this tiny little lump here. Yeah, that sucks. Fire on the earth. The plans Kazook. Oh yeah, I have this too. Cannon! Right, that did some pretty freaking nasty damage. Pretty big, pretty big bang of thunder just happened outside. Alright. You guys go there. Let's throw negation on top of that stuff. Bring us me. Send you guys around that flank with the hammerers up. Iron breakers. You come over here, hit that. We also have... Some lightning we can throw down. Send in you boys. Yeah, it sure does help to have an army that's not, like, ridiculously green. Oh, this is AoE? Are you freaking kidding me? Age, wealth, and skill. Hearth and home. Holy. It is a well, that's busted. War of vengeance. Cannon. To the high chain. That is just, like, absolutely freaking... Absolutely friggin' nuts. Stop down for the ancestors. Okay, uh, here, just a second. I gotta finish clicking on a bunch of stuff, and then I'll explain what that does. Go. For for the audience watching at home, doesn't may not realize exactly how freaking broken that is. So this is the ancestral rune of Grangini. Uh, in an AoE, it makes everyone invulnerable to damage, gives them 24 melee attack, and unbreakable. Three t yeah, you could do it three times. <laughs> I thought it was- I thought it was single target because it said unit is invulnerable. Not everybody in the circle Jeebus. That's... That's insane. But why? But why not? Holy hell. It does say area. Yeah, it also says unit. <laughs> it 
So it depends on what you choose to believe. I want gold, not prisoners! Off we go! Thoric Iron Brow! Yeah, so... It says unit is invulnerable. Affects allies in range. Affect range 40 meters. Allies could mean one unit of multiple guys. And effect range 40 meters, unless you know that it's a global spell, could mean the range from your character that's holding the rune to the guy that you're casting it on. But because it's global, because it goes on the side of the... It, it's not on him, it like goes on the side over here. Yeah, it's just worded in a way that doesn't make any sense until you see it in action. It's just busted. Yeah, I mean, true. <laughs> 35 seconds, too. And you could use it three times with a 120-second cooldown. I mean, if it just made an AoE of people invulnerable, that would be insane. But it also adds 24 melee attack and unbreakable on top of that. It's whew, crazy. Let's get strike the runes. Reduce all rune magic cooldowns. That sounds good. Get missile resist on him, I guess. Mr. Thane Man, Scar Veteran. Iron Will. All right. Well, a step too far. That's what happens when those guys fight a real army, as opposed to the my crappy army. <laughs> You imagine that with hammers? Yowza. Or slayers. <laughs> I mean, they wouldn't need the unbreakable, obviously, but you could be like, here's a bunch of giant slayers. Invulnerable. Just DPSing out the yin-yang. <laughs> My gosh. So that's pretty good. I mean, I thought it was going to be good if it was a single unit. I was like, ah, oh, yeah, that's probably pretty okay for... You got, like, you got, like, one guy getting jumped on, you just freaking make him invulnerable, and then they can't mess with anymore, or this guy's getting charged or something, you're just like, you're invulnerable. You can legitimately make your entire front line just be like, no, nah, we don't care. Invulnerable giant slayers when you need to mow down your enemies. I wonder how the giant slayers would feel about that. No! Why? I want to die! Please! <laughs> Why do you do this? Let's do that. Ready! Ready! On the way! See, what's our relationship with the Court of Liberus? I think we have a trade agreement with them, is what's going on? Yeah, we just have a trade agreement with them, that's it. The goddess, so let us cancel this trade agreement. Because we need to go over there and take their item. Onward. Will. Yeah, you better run away. On our way. Taxes and I'm a Gee, yeah, you ain't making it, friend. So it's Goodbye. Good. Steeg. Let's see what you're worth. Rune of dismay. Lost glories reclaimed. I like how there's bridges here, but they don't actually work. <laughs> we honor the ancestors. 
bone bending. You know what? I'm not afraid of these guys. We're just gonna walk around here. Yeah, there we go. I am not afraid. Uh, hammers, iron breaker units. It's kind of like this too. That's yeah, Grimnir's heirs, and then we're gonna make like fire and fury probably. Settlement upgrade available. Oh, heck yeah. Mechanic Islands. There we go. We get just some obsidian going as well. Our growth building. So otherwise, it's going to take forever. We can finish leveling up that gold mine. And we can start finally getting walls here, too. We got enough money to just freaking sock money into this as well. We get another barracks so we get another thing. Or we could get a hull of oats, I suppose, so we get another thing. Yeah, let's do that. Victory for the old way. Okay. Uh, how's my diplomacy looking? Medium still. All right, I'm gonna run the turn. I need to pee. I'll be right back. One more road jumping. I mean, it's a valid question, you. Uh, more of the racehorse kind, because I've been holding it for a while. <laughs> Freebooters. Arcane wisdom. Severe. Tried and tested. He made to level ten. Ship to Scar veteran. Versed in the ways of horse beasts, I'm intrigued. Since good mentioned it this morning. Not a chance. <laughs> you would be. I'm listening. For the ancestors. All right, what do we got here? Close victory, eh? Somehow I highly doubt that's going to be the case. Considering how... Considering how viciously these guys got trashed in the last fight. Similar verse we say in Dutch. What's that one? Translated, obviously, because if you say it in... <laughs> Say it in Dutch, I won't be able to understand it at all. Uh, but then it can either be a racehorse or a post horse, like horses used to haul mail carriages. Ah, okay. Quirrellous. I wonder if they did the same thing to them to make them lighter and faster. I suppose it makes sense. Being horsest. Satisfy the crunch. You got a what now? Water what to who? Got a rash wear? Long bits. All right, you guys go over here. You guys go over here. Over there. For a iron brow. All right, this should be good enough. <laughs> hey, ready? Get that out of the way. <laughs> See. Ya. I'm gonna light up these freaking chariots, because I believe these guys have seeking shot as well. Can't remember. Grudge throwers throw light up these chaos knights on the sides. Yeah, 
And we have our rune of pure concentrated BS ready to go when he decides to charge me. Light these guys up over here. I'm gonna move him off to the right, actually. Bring you guys in here. You guys on top of that. Let's make all these guys invulnerable. This Lightning on top of that. You guys charging on those chariots. There's a whole bunch of guys sitting over here on the right. Gonna pull the cannons back and around here, I think. Move you guys in. Let's do this. It's the one that reduces speed. Is that AoE? Can I make it AoE? No, it's only one unit. That sucks. Alright, so there's... There's gonna be a bunch of guys coming hard around our flank here. They're like, currently, I imagine they're working their way like back this way because they want to get around to my artillery. And back the guys, these guys up here. Thane up here. Mm, they might be coming back around. Carnosaur in there. You get on top of him. There. Uh, let's see. You hit those dudes. Slow them down. Pull these guys back to charge these Chaos Knights. There we go. So what happens? We send a boy to do a man's job. His name is just Carl. <laughs> ah, yes. The famed Chaos Marauder. Carl. <laughs> ah, yeah, these have the increased bonus versus large and enables projectiles to home on target. Also, the violin glitch is still around. Now we're just going to raise this. We don't about it. We just want the artifact. That's what we came for. Enchanted alchemy vial. Oh, has the hung warband destroyed as well. Not so hung now, are ya? Maybe from a tree. Don't care about this. Don't care about this. Clones corruption, I guess? Sure. <laughs> That's a passive that we could have. I'm a run on Do I have any items sitting around that this guy could wear? Or use? Oh yeah, that's right. I, the Masamuna's weapon the gifts got removed. Of have hey, our reliability is back up to high. Uh, okay. So let's see here. Let's go to Axolotl. How much money would it take? Low. Moderate. Jesus. Okay, uh, how about you guys? Oh, it's you. Excellent. Oh, actually, uh, that'd be high already? Okay, cool. Consider it done. Alright, so I will go to 18. Alright, so if we could go over here to the Blood Hall and take that item, and then if we can get a military alliance with these guys and get this item, 
They're looking pretty okay. Master of Runecraft, Run Ricky. All right. This army, let us get. We could do flame cannons. Flame cam cannons are cool. All right, we already have some artillery though. Um. So let's just let's throw down some iron breakers here. Soon we shall be oh gosh, covered by wheat. Dope. Did you say wheat? Wheat. Wheat. I'm dead. They're talking about wheat. <laughs> Thank you, Pop Grace Dope, for the 250 bits. Uh, I gotta start moving. No option watch adverts and wheat. <laughs> but thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, hopefully work goes fast today. You can get in and out. <laughs> Not too much trouble. I wish we had the bread alert more often. <laughs> it's a rare alert. Always our best. All right. Um. Yeah. So we just need to move down to the Court of Liberius and nuke them so we can get the item. Ah, <laughs> beer alert. Have you come to atone for your transgressions? The heck are you? A non no, 10,000 for a non-aggression pack? Jesus. Uh, Sir, calm yourself. <laughs> That's a lot of money. That's like big boy money. I mean, I know I got a hundred grand right now, but that, that, I need to spend that for diplomatic reasons. <laughs> That's not with you. I need to give Teclas like a hundred grand so he'll be my friend and hand over a freaking artifact. Only vengeance will make me happy. Really? You're gonna be that guy? This army's not actually that big. It's not Greetings. horribly afraid of it. It's bothersome. And then some random pirates apparently declaring war on me, I guess. Sure. Whatever. Rune Lord of Garakasol. All right, so now I got my now I got to get out of here. How like am I do gonna do that without hacking everybody off? Um, I guess I go back this way towards the. Quick about it. We head back this way towards the awakening, I suppose. Lord of Clan Mark. Hey, you gained a level. Route marcher. I'm done ready. Scolder guard. Skyhammer gyro bomber. Create this place. Cobra pass. We start getting walls here. Upgrade the gems. And the growth building. At your service. Groby Nutter to head up this way. I think we probably want to wait a couple turns before we try. So that actually improves a bit. This army is being constructed anyway. So we want to be able to get over here and take out the Blood Hall. Almost to the final battle. Hey, Balzy. How's it going, my man? Ah. Still curious why this admiral is all the way down here. It's like at the bottom of the world, basically. <laughs> that guy doesn't have a very good army for assaulting anywhere, honestly. He's just got a bunch of like 
Death Runners and Spider Guys. There we go. Uh, gem Cutters is 20% from Gem Cutters and Obsidian Quarries. Yes, please. Halls of Great Guilds. I think not. Quite, can't quite get over the wall here, unfortunately. Sad. You jump in there. That's almost done. Volcanic Islands. Obsidian Sculptor. And that. How are we looking here with our relationship with Floor Masters? It's at five. I'm techless. Uh, Defensive I'm Alliance. Master of the White Tower. Uh, money. Here, take money. I have lots of money. You want it? Low. Low. Dang it. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you in a second. Uh, don't worry, I'll be back. With even more, with even more cash than before. Uh, let's get some troll hammer torpedoes. Did some exercising, finished TV setup. Nice. Nice. Look at this guy, exercising. Did you jazzercise? Inquiring minds need to know. Uh, probably some quarrelers at this point. Yeah, we'll get some quarrelers. Iron will. Runelot. That's maxed out. That can't get any higher right now. Hey, that'll be a while. Yeah, that's probably about as good as it's gonna get. What is jazzercising? It's like a exercising, but it's like the music. It's supposed to make exercising more interesting. <laughs> I could have spent my life, or spent my time so much better. <laughs> you could have been jazzercising the whole time. But here you are now. Jazzless. Lord of Clan Margaret. 